What's happening, fam? LAR movement still moving. Subscribe or die trying. You see the thumbnail. 2022, the year of the black manosphere. Say, you got a lot of people. Like I was talking to one of my one of my good friends, uh, and he was and he was like, you know, the black manosphere is having more of an impact than you think because it used to kind of be just an internet thing, and now it's become it's becoming commonplace. So, in my opinion, um, 2022 is going to be the year of the Black Manosphere because it's really going to be the coming out party for a lot of different people. You know, people uh, definitely gravitate um, to Kevin Samuels, right? And then, and people, everybody knows who O'Shea is. So, you're going to see the other content creators grow exponentially, just in my opinion. And because what's going to wind up happening is, I think the 2022 is going to be the year of the Black Manosphere because there are going to be a lot of guys who just come online and say they're part of the Black Manosphere because they feel it's going to be lucrative for them. Whether they they agree with what we've been saying or some of the, or they disagree, they're just going to say, oh, I'm in the Black Manosphere, and, and brother's going to be like, no, you're not. See, see, people seem to think that you could just be a Black man of any culture, of any nationality, and just say I'm black, so I'm in the black manosphere. And the people who've been in this space for years are just gonna let you ride with that. Not gonna happen. So before anybody, you know, um, runs to the front of the line, um, they're gonna have to be vetted. And what you're gonna wind up seeing is um, the black manosphere that you didn't see. I, you know, because the one that's relationship based is definitely um, at the forefront. But if you even if you even notice with Kevin, he brings the, the statistics into that. He brings the other life things into that. You know, you're gonna see people with this with the with the automation talk, and even in the crypto talk. Uh, you're gonna see the people talk about just life in general. You know what I'm saying? You're gonna see the political talk. You're gonna see. The race relations talk. You're going to see all of that. And because black men in particular have a completely different experience in America than anybody else. You know, you're going to see um, the America talk, the conservative part, the liberal part. You're going to see all of that. And it's going to be kind of, as I can see, shocking because you, I see people coming, seeing the black manosphere and, and having a, a culture shock. You know, they're black men who like, you know, in culture shock, like, whoa, you know, oh, fine. black men are talking like this publicly. It's about time. I love it. I'm, I'm, I'm all in. And then you go have black men like, oh, black men are talking like this publicly. Uh, 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 you're not going to mess up my good thing. I got to shut it down. And, and you're going to see that dichotomy because you're going to see the, 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 the internal war at odds of, you know, Guys who don't like the way it is and guys who do like the way it is. And you're going to see their, their, their reasons for why they don't like it and the reasons for why they do like it. And you're going to pick a side. And, and, and to be perfectly honest, yeah, I'm biased because I'm in the black manosphere, but I think I'm one of, I'm objective. The guys that under, that, um, <clears throat> that are for the black manosphere are going to look a whole lot better than the guys that are against, you know, so to me, this is going to be the year of the black manosphere. And how can I put this? Because I've seen it in anybody who's been in a space, who's been a content creator in a space, or who's just been in the space for years, they can tell you in social media and um, um, they have all these shows and, and, and topics. A lot of the, 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 the black manosphere has impacted a lot of social media and and entertainment television space without being referenced. You know what I'm saying? Like uh, the talking points, the topics, the interactions, the way things are set up, the things we, we discussed have, have been really right at the forefront of a lot of things. It's just you didn't have a, a you didn't this, you didn't have a the space didn't didn't get recognized. The people in the space didn't get recognized. So now you're going to see the space get recognized more and people get recognized 
particularly, like specifically this person, that person. Um, you're going to see like some people in academia love it. Some people in academia hate it. Um, you're going to see the narrative because people, because the black manosphere is growing, you're going to see more and more people um, putting a narrative on the space. But see, these our pages are out here. Our, our topics are out here. Our, our discussions, our podcasts are out here. So you don't have to take people's word because what you've noticed is people will take a, a clip and then put that onto a person. And, but then when you go listen to the person, it's like, okay, this is deeper than what somebody's saying. Somebody's just throwing shade and they hating because they're talking about a specific thing at this particular point. This is not them specifically about everything. They have views about a lot of different things. And maybe I don't like this view, but I actually see where they're coming from. Or I actually agree with what they're saying. But somebody told me, you know, in a way that I would disagree with it. But as I'm listening to it, it's like, no, they got a point. So because a lot of people are, I hate to say this, but they're wired backwards in their mind. They think, you know, if you say anything <clears throat> negatively about black women at any point, everything you say is irrelevant, not taken into consideration. You know, a lot, we have a lot more relevant things and, and um, realistic information and experiences and, and, tr and, and true encounters about life across the board than everybody else. And because we have a lot of people from different walks of life, you can't get around it. You just cannot get around it. And now, you know, it's going to put uh, the black community in particular on blast, even the television show type community, because for years they didn't have heterosexual black men on all of these shows. You know, it's just been the black panderers. That's it. Now you're going to have people like, they're going to have to call guys from the black manosphere because they're going to want trying to throw us under the bus for one. But then... But a lot of them don't want to, they want to have particular people online. And we know that too. You know, I want to get this particular person because they said something crazy so I can hit them with the, I'm going to hit them with this clip for five seconds. You said that, blah, blah. And they're going to blitzkrieg them, but not realizing these guys have been uh, on panels for so long that, and had these conversations for so long, they're already actually media savvy. They know what you're going to do before you do it. So their responses are going to be off the chain as far as you're not going to get around how you, how you, how you look. And the viewers have changed over the years. Viewers have changed over the years because viewers are tired of getting played. So I think the black manosphere is one of the most honest spaces. So you can't help it. And there are going to be some guys in the space who y'all going to realize people don't really rock with like that, but they're in the space, but it's like, eh, you know, so to think that everybody's, you know, brothers can be unified in the same space and not get along, but we're still we're still cordial. We don't beef like that. It's not it's not like rap. You get what I'm saying? So you see that brothers can get along and grow and not get along and not bother each other. So that's a whole nother thing part. That's a whole nother part of it that's gonna help it grow also. But I'm done. Like, share, subscribe, or die, try and catch you on the next one. Peace.